Hey guys, welcome to another edition of Screens Off. Today we are going to be doing some backyard camping. Now, backyard camping is something you can do in your backyard, but if you don't have a backyard, maybe, maybe you're lucky enough to have a deck or a balcony you could camp outside in. But if you really don't want to camp out in your backyard, you could do it indoors as well too, in the family room or in a dining room, maybe even in a basement if you have one. But here today we're going to talk a little bit mainly about camping in your backyard. Now here I have my setup for backyard camping, a pretty basic setup. Let's look a little bit closer. Now there's three things you really need to camp in your backyard. Uh, one being a tent, main reason being so that you can be protected from the weather, from the wind, uh, to make sure that you know no animals can come in and say hello to you in the night, maybe a neighborhood cat or something like that. Uh, the other big thing you're going to need is some sort of sleeping bag. Now, a sleeping bag isn't totally mandatory, but it does make things a lot warmer, helps to keep you all contained. You can substitute a sleeping bag uh, with just blankets. You can take a bunch of blankets off your bed, or maybe you have some extra linen, uh, and you can use that to sleep under. And then the third thing you're going to need, if you're sleeping outside, is some sort of ground mattress. So I have here this great big foam inflatable mattress that rolls up. Uh, this is just to help deal with the lumps and bumps of sleeping on a bumpy ground. Helps to make things nice and level and a little bit more comfortable. Also helps to keep things a little bit warmer. The ground can be cold at night and uh, the mat will help insulate you from the ground a little bit. Now again, this is another thing you don't 100% need. Uh, you can substitute blankets for this. You can take several layers of blankets and build them up. That's what people used to do. Uh, and building up those layers of blankets will help to smooth out the lumps and bumps and it will help to insulate you as well. So in reality, uh, you just really need a whole bunch of blankets. You don't need a sleeping bag and a ground mattress. You could do with just a bunch of blankets as well too. Now, in terms of non-essential essentials, kind of like secondary essentials, I would recommend you take some sort of pillow to sleep with. You take something to drink. So I have here a water bottle all set up, ready to go for the having a little quick sip of water in the night. Uh, I'd also recommend some sort of entertainment bra magazine that I just got in the mail today. Be able to sleep out in the backyard and read a little bit. And finally, a flashlight. Flashlights are really good just to help you to see in the dark. Sometimes it gets a little bit darker before you're ready to go to sleep. And this way I can you know, still read for a bit in the night and turn out the light when it's ready to go to bed. Now if you ever have to go in the bathroom, best part about camping out in your backyard, you just go inside. That's the best part overall about camping out in your backyard. If you ever get scared and you don't want to camp out anymore, if the weather gets really bad and you don't want to camp out anymore, just go inside. The house is usually a few steps away and you can just hop right in. There's nothing keeping you from camping indoors. You probably have a living room or a dining room or a rec room or the basement where you could set up a tent, get your sleeping bag and your mat and have your own camp out inside your home. Maybe the weather's really bad outside and you really want to have a camp out. You can still go inside, set up your tent and your sleeping bag and have fun indoors. If you're really lucky, you can maybe set it up by the TV. You can even have like a movie night before you go to sleep. And that way, everyone can have a chance to go camping. So I'm all set up for my backyard camping adventure. I got my entertainment. I got my water bottle. I have my flashlight nearby. I'm going to grab it real quick. And I'm all ready to settle in for the night. So, have fun with your backyard camping adventure. I hope you guys will share some pictures on Facebook just to show me your camping setups. And we will see you next week for the next Screens Off activity. Have a good night.